Greetings everyone, my name is Ari Steele and welcome back to Dragon Ball Fighters. On our last adventure, we found out Vegeta became a surfer, was emitted some gnarly waves across the world, causing people to become clones and all other sorts of weird pittedness. But I discovered what the map icons are all about here. So the ones with the question marks are battle tutorials, which I'm going to try to avoid those as best as possible. I actually hope at some point they're no longer about on the map the further I get into the game. But these ones here with the little people icons are rescue missions. So what I'm going to do is I came back to map 4 where I last fought Cell. And I'm going to rescue Yamcha and Tien and add them to the team. Because the more the merrier. And I need all the help I can get to help fight these clones and find out what the hell is going on. And who this red ribbon bitch truly Whoa, is. We found Yamcha! Yay! He seems to be okay. <laughs> He's in his natural condition. Goku, Krillin, did you come to rescue me? Unfortunately. Yamcha, you weren't even knocked out. Yeah, well. Is he playing dead? I can speak, but only just barely. Bet you he's playing coy. Me, I was out cold. You're actually in pretty good shape. Imagine that. <laughs> Don't say. What happened to me anyway? Feels like I got hit by a truck. Where to begin? Oh no, it's a Yamcha clone. Every run, run. Crap! Another clone's appeared! Krillin, save it for later. Let's deal with this guy first. You could just sneeze on him, I'm pretty sure he'll die. The battle's about to start! Good luck! I mean, the only real threat would be the clone Goku, really. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just Yamcha's just so easy to target. He's such a useless character. Oh, that's one down. All right, evil me. Ah, oh, damn it. There we go. Powered up in front of him like an idiot. Yamcha is now playable. I'm so ecstatic. At least Krillin leveled up. That was good. <sighs> At least I can move a bit more freely now. Anyway, I think I get the picture. So it was those waves from that thing Bulma made that paralyzed me all of a sudden, huh? I don't exactly like having my power sealed, but I guess our enemies are in the same boat. But I'm sure you'll work it out. No, Yamcha, you're as much a part of this as we are. Fact. Really need more good fighters to join us. Krillin, now's not the time for jokes. Seriously? Yeah, Yamcha. So what do you say? You feel like fighting side by side with us again? Wow, uh, I don't know. I kind of retired a while back. My martial arts skills are going to be kind of rusty. Are you sure you even want me to fight? Huh? Of course we do, Yamcha. I mean, you're already wearing your gi. Of course we want you to. See? Even Krillin's gonna be fighting, so the more the merrier. Yeah, but Krillin's a lot more reliable. Don't worry, you'll be fine. Even, huh? You really got away with words, Goku. Well, every team needs cannon fodder, I guess. Alright, now to move on to TN. Ally saved. Yamcha is now available to edit team menu. Oh, uh, I'm gonna just hold off for now, and I'm gonna go up here and get TN now. Hey, Chiaotzu! Get away from me! Tien, I'll protect you! Stop! Do you mind if we join you? Goku? But what are you guys doing here? Chiaotzu, you really held your own out there. 
You can leave this to the rest of us. Okay. Thanks, guys. Over here, clone. We're your opponents now. Da -da -da. A fierce showdown is about to begin. All right, let's do this. I'm actually curious to find out how much more difficult these clones get the further you get into the game. Or if at some point you stop fighting clones altogether. <laughs> Thanks for just letting me power up right in front of you. You're a real trope to the series. Punch it right in your triclopic eye. Power up in front of him. There we go. I give Krillin a little bit of action here. Can't just have it be all Goku. Chien is now playable. Perfect. Now I gotta figure out how to actually access the map options. Is that you? What happened to me? Everyone showed up and rescued us! What do you mean? What's going on? I can explain if you really want, but it's a little complicated. So, those peculiar waves are behind it all. What a mess. If it's alright with you, I'd like to fight too. You're gonna fight? Tian... Are you sure that's a good idea? It is a great idea. Oh no! Can you even move okay? I appreciate your concern, Chatsu. But... I'm fine. If I don't fight at times like these, then what am I training for? Tian! Chatsu... I want you to... I want to fight too! I'm not scared! I want to help you, Tian! Chatsu... I can do it! We always train together! I know I can be of use. Yeah, you can be another sacrificial lamb. Very well. Then we fight together. Just promise never to leave my side. You got that? Promise. Nah, I'm just throwing a jab at Chaozu. He's actually a lot stronger than Yamcha, surprisingly enough. But that's because he's always training. He's not trying to go about these get-rich-quick schemes. Alright, now I can add Tian to the team, which I believe I'm actually going to do. Alright, here we go. Back into the new map. Ooh, so I can go get Trunks. Um, hell yeah, alright, so we'll just go fight Yamcha. Oh, that was Yamcha, Cell, and Captain Ginyu. This should be a great fight. And it's just me? Why? I mean, I don't mind, but I thought I had Krillin and Tien on my team as well. Did it not save that? Let's go. How's this for starters? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this is another thing, huh? Alright, mid-air recover. Come on, hit me. There we go. You really blew me away there. Try this one next. Back in You know what I don't care I don't care about these damn tutorials anymore enough. I don't care. It's let me just fight. That's all I want to do. That's all this game is about. That's the entire premise behind Dragon Ball is to fight. Problem is, I gotta be careful though, because I'm half health. 
yourself. It's a rematch of the century, but not really because you're just a clone. I'll give you a Kamehameha in the face. There we go. Perfect. Victory health recovery level one. Oh, so I get more health recovery on wins. I gotcha, gotcha. I gotta edit my team. I can't believe I removed Tien and Krillin. Uh-oh. Oh! A clone of Kid Buu, Destroyer of Earth, has appeared. He has taken over an enemy's space and is absorbing that energy to power up. He's a powerful foe to be sure, but you stand to gain a lot of experience if you defeat him. Take him on if you think you've got what it takes. Well then. That sounds interesting. But first, I gotta get Trunks. Ooh, Trunks, Vegeta, and Goku. Level 5, huh? Damn, I don't have much for health either. But I can get Majin Buu as a playable character. Oh, I saw Buu there. Okay, I automatically thought it was Trunks because it was him on the map. Much like it was with Yamcha and Tien. Oh, Buu, wake up. <laughs> uh, is he asleep? What do you think? He was exactly the same during that written test we had. Totally asleep. He's out like a light. Do you think it could have something to do with the waves? Or it could just be the fact that he's in an awesome sauna location. The warmth is really doing well for his skin. Hello, clone. Goku! Over there! Another clone showed up! Yeah, we've proven we can handle them. Stop freaking out, Krillin. Damn. They get all worked up over nothing. Time to begin the match. They're level 5, though, so I gotta be careful. They're getting slightly tougher. But I wonder if levels just coincide with their health pools, not their overall skills. I mean, thus far, because they really haven't been doing a lot of attacking or... Get Krillin in here. Now we'll get Tien in here because I want to try him out. That was a pretty weak try beam. What's the actual, what's the Japanese translation for try beam? Is it Kikon Goho? Get out of the way. Nice finish. At least I hit him with it. Wait, why did T-Ed lose health? I don't remember getting hit by him. Or any of them. That was weird. Huh? Rise and shine, Boo. Boo, do you even recognize us? Oh, and by the way, you're lying in the dirt. He's in a ship, Goku. Ooh. Hey! Did you say Boo? Do you like chocolate? Hmm. What's going on? Boo can't move well. Yeah, about that. You've got some weird waves to think. Let me explain what's going on. <laughs> and thus Boma explained. Did you get all that? I'm pretty sure he didn't. <laughs> uh, I'll start again from the beginning, okay? And thus again, Boma explained. 
You get weak. Strange waves fault. You beat up bad guys, okay? One more time? <laughs> Ugh, I've had it with you. How can I make it any clearer than that? <laughs> hey, just relax, Bulma. Hey, guys, let me try explaining it to Boo. You see, there's this soul inside of us who helps us fight the bad guys. He's not going to understand that either. Aw, got my hopes up for nothing. Hey, that's okay. Bulma will make you the best pudding in the entire universe. Uh, remember the last time he had pudding? We almost lost the Earth because of that. What? I will? Really? Better than pudding boo, ain't it, party? My god, he remembers. Uh, sure, way better than that stuff. But you gotta fight on our side first, okay? Boo, understand. First boo fight, then boo get pudding! Really okay with this? Do you think you could even make pudding that good? No. You're gonna owe me for this, Goku. <laughs> God, Goku just likes throwing everybody under the bus. Just to satisfy his own lust for fighting. Majibu has been saved. Yay! Alright, so now you know what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come here. I don't know if I want to try that Majin Buu battle right there. Only because of how they described him as being powerful, I don't want to risk it. Because I'm pretty low on health as is. So I'm just going to jump and fight Cell. Which it's now Cell, Captain Ginyu, and Nappa. Alright, but I get health up level 2. Uh, oh no, that's the enemy skill. But I win defense up level 1. Cool. I think I got one of those before. Can I combine those and make it level 2? There's so much about this system I still don't understand. I need to figure out all the little mechanics. I just like jumping in and beating the crap out of people. Get ready. Give it your best shot. I don't wanna. Oh, so that's how you do the thing. Turn the tables with a sparking blast. I wasn't the guard cancel, but okay. Time for revenge! What you get for blowing off my arm and causing Chao Tzu to blow himself up? He lost both of his arms, and his legs, and body. He just died. It's all your fault. Nice. That wasn't too, too bad. I know I said before that I'm probably going to edit out some of the clone battles, but I figure I may as well keep them in, since they go by really quick. Piccolo revive. Blast it all! How is this possible? Why aren't their powers as diminished as mine are? This isn't fair. Ah, oh, cry me a river. How can I, the perfect being, be defeated? <laughs> a sorry sight you were, Cell. That's Frieza. Frieza. Hope you don't mind me. Observing this delightful spectacle from afar. 
remember, we had a deal. A deal you chose to ignore just so you could run off on your own and fail miserably. Tell me, how was your showdown with that filthy primate? <laughs> I don't have to tell you anything. He got his butt whooped. <laughs> so that's how it is. Well, perhaps we can strike a deal. Another one? My subordinates have acquired information that might be of some small interest to you. Oh, by subordinates, I assume you mean that over-choreographed circus troupe? What an embarrassment they are to your cause. I'm sure you're very proud. Uh, but yes. They are called the Ginyu Force. Does this not entice you? My precious intel, that is. What say you to a deal? Tell me what you know. And I'd be happy to tell you what I know. I highly doubt they know anything. Hey, um... Hello? Who's that inside my head right now? It's me. Coco. Coco. No, it's Piccolo. Piccolo? Come quick. They're too strong. Who is? And where? I'm sensing a small energy distortion. That way! But I'm still too weak to use instant transmission. Ooh, that's a lot of baddies. Alright, um, so Piccolo's that way. Closest would be to go here, then here. Uh, health recovery bonus level one. All right, let's do it. But yeah, as I was mentioning before, like I was thinking of cutting these battles out just because of the sake of time and try to get more of the Standing plot. Standing in front of Piccolo's clone reminds me of when we fought him in the world tournament. I wanted to try to get more of the plot into the videos as much as possible, but since there's reactions like this, I may as well just leave them in because I don't know when they're going to show up. Oh, that was quite some time ago. Yeah, Piccolo's definitely changed a bunch since then, huh? He's not a bad guy anymore. <laughs> Indeed. He doesn't seem to have a shred of evil left in him anymore. Nope, he's the world's best dad. Oh, by the way, did you know Piccolo babysits Pan when Gohan and his wife are out of the house? Isn't that neat? So convenient. <laughs> he calms her down and changes her diapers. I hear he's pretty good at it. Well, he's had experience with your own son. Not like you would know. He even makes baby food for her. Definitely the perfect babysitter. Piccolo changing diapers? I can't tell which one of you is actually Pan's grandfather anymore. Oh, Tien called it! Hey, you sound just like Chi-Chi. She says Piccolo makes a better grandpa than me. Oh my god! <laughs> I don't think that's something you should be particularly proud of as Pan's actual grandfather. <laughs> yeah, god, Goku's such a ditz. Listen, and I don't think you should go telling people that Piccolo is taking care of your granddaughter. Huh? Why's that? Uh, well, to protect Piccolo's image, I guess. Yeah, it's a good reason. One of His them. His image? <laughs> let's end this conversation here, shall we? Yeah, let's take care of this Piccolo clone and show him who's Grandpa. I love how the clone hey. just sat there and let them have that conversation. It's like, oh, you guys done talking? Okay. For the Piccolo, Ginyu, and Nappa once again. Oh, one thing I'm actually surprised they didn't implement was the fight loading during those cutscenes so that it just jumps right into it. I don't know how to charge my key, but thanks. Um, all right, I'll do that on Ginyu then. Yeah, 
Um, do I not have enough energy? Probably not. Power up. There we go. I guess that wasn't a super attack. I don't know how it wouldn't be. Or maybe I just don't have enough energy to pull off a super attack. Either way. That's fine. I know I said I don't want to get involved with the tutorials and all that, but they're just distracting. I kind of want to get them out of the screen so I can just move on with the battle. Alright, let's go rescue Piccolo now. If anything happens to him, both Gohan and Pan will lose a father. The best father anyone Look, could ask for. Yeah, and? Man, it's like I can't go two minutes without bumping into one of these clones. Well, I know what I gotta do. Yeah, they are getting rather annoying. I would like to fight some actual people. It's time to face your opponent. Clones just aren't that powerful. They're not even a challenge. They don't really fight back all that often. So I'm thinking my theory holds true where their levels just correspond with their health pool. It's all or nothing. Let's go. That's all you got? Yeah. Yeah. Here comes. Get out of here. Fantastic. Yeah. 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 I'll be sure to visit your brain. Amazing. Yeah. Hell away from me. Oh, no. yeah. Ow, stop it. Yeah. Be sure to visit your That's what you get. Nice. Yeah. Alright, let me finish off Piccolo and then I'll see if I can do an yeah. ultimate to Goku. Clone Goku, not me. Okay, it was the same as before. I don't think it was anything different. Alright, let's get Tien in here. I want to see his ultimate. That's it. Oh shit. Oh, they actually are fighting back. They're able to do combos. Piccolo is now playable. Perfect. Yeah, done did it. I'm starting to get a pretty powerful team going here. Good. I can finally move again. I'm glad you're okay. But I have to tell you that things have taken a turn for the worse. If you're referring to the waves and that linking business, then I already know about all of that. Huh? But I didn't even... Look, I'd rather not listen to you explain. It was easier just to read your mind. <laughs> you read my mind? You see, Piccolo used to be Connie. Reading minds is just old hat to him. Hey... Just what else did you look at without my permission, huh? Your boobies. Don't tell me. You saw memories of me taking a bath, didn't you? Oh, God, really? I might have seen something like that amongst the jumble. What of it? What's that supposed to mean? Have you no respect for a girl's privacy? It's the fact that he just doesn't care. Hold up. Why 
would a Namekian be interested in girls anyway, Bulma? Exactly, they're asexual. They self-produce. Hold on there. Aren't you a little too old to be calling yourself a girl? Oh. <laughs> At least now I know the state of affairs. Go Hold on. So you're linked with Goku? Well, you've really gotten yourself into a nasty situation. Still, we're gonna need you now more than ever. I'll join the fight from here. Whatever I can do to help. Nice. His diaper chaining powers are back at maximum. Piccolo, now available. Beautiful. Alright, so. No one else to rescue and just heading right down there. Um. Alright, so I think I'm going to save this for next time. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to get through all these fights, so then at the beginning of the next episode, I'll just jump right into the story. And I won't have to worry about dealing with any of these uh, tutorials and all that. But anyway, I'm going to pause it right here. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then thrust your mouse upon that like button. Keep playing it awesome, and I will see you all on my next adventure.